Okay, I did the unboxing of the Casio EXZ35 12.1 megapixel camera. Now, I'm going to show you some specs on this camera. I already owned it. I, had, I returned it and I wanted to go get it back because it was worth keeping in the beginning. I got my hands on Olympus Stylus 550W, which is garbage. And my unboxing explains why that's garbage. So, let me continue with this video and not go over 10 minutes of nonsense with you. Because neither you or I have time to waste. Now, the battery is showing like this with the contacts. And you can see on the bottom, the 2 to 2. Just drop it as you see it. That gets pushed down. The little lock keeps it in place, the battery. This door gets locked by you. By pushing the little lock button towards you, back way opens and pushes this towards you and locks it. And also, I've got to mention the unboxing a little bit of the review with this. Is this is your USB AV port? So this little rubber, this little rubber flap, right there. That stays pretty well down, good enough. And I took the two-year warranty out with Razor Shack, like I explained already, but just to give you some heads up. Two-year plan, this is good to 2012, 18 bucks, and it covers everything but accidental and water surge. <laughs> I don't plan on throwing my camera in the toilet bowl, but here's what Radio Shack covers, everything. Here's what normal limited warranty with Sony, Casio, Fuji, Nikon, Samsung. List goes on. That's it. You you pay for everything. You don't hear Radio Shack. Not only Radio Shack. You get a plan with Target, Walmart, everybody. So that takes care of that. Now let's get down to this one. Power it on right here, and it goes on. Now this was mine already, so I know everything about it, and it's already kind of set. I also return this because it was not keeping the time correctly. I don't know why, but I can always have that turned off when I'm taking pictures. So it is not, or just keep it on. Doesn't matter. This, the the date stays, and the time gets kind of messed up. It does not keep, but that's okay. This was my model that I went to go back at Radio Shack. They said if you give you a new one because of the problems you think you were having, you'd be charged a stocking fee. If you take the one you had, brought us back, and take it back, we won't charge you. So I own this one already. And it's no big deal. And let's go to right now. Let's see what the BS is for. On the bottom right corner. That gives you your settings. Best shot settings. So you got. Wait a minute. I kind of went out of whack there. That's auto. Let me do something guys. Hold on. Let me zoom out. Okay. That's auto. That's portrait. That's scenery. S scenery or something. Scenery. What am I talking about? That's scenery. I need my glasses on. I can't see good. Portrait with scenery. Children. Sports. Candlelight. Portrait. Party. Pet. Flower. Soft flowing water sundown like I explained in my unboxing I took sunset and sunrise with this sundown it came out excellent I gotta do all my videos over okay we've got um what is this one now hold on kind of okay you got food fireworks night scene portrait Night scene. Text. If you got to take a picture of documents. For eBay. Selling on eBay. You have a mode for that. You have backlight. Anti-shake. High sensitivity. For YouTube. And voice recording. These all are awesome. Even the Olympus stylus I had did not have this. And that was a piece of junk. I never liked that camera in the first place. Okay. Hit. BS. Now we're going to go right to the setting mode, I think, for now. Yes, we'll go to settings. You have your settings there. 
set display date you can change your picture size all the way down from 12 pixel to VGA format flash on or off right there face detection your your um, IS, ISO goes all up to 1600 <clears throat> daylight auto white balance daylight overcast shade day white fluorescent daylight fluorescent or oh, that is tungsten don't know what that is manual white balance auto white balance your EV whatever I don't play around with that easy mode off your date and time display now we're gonna get out of here so we're gonna go to menu and then menu again record you got your autofocus focus frame CS self timer phase detection anti shock AF area easy mode LR key grid digital zoom review icon help and memory go to quality size you have 12 megapixel or scroll over you got 3.2 you got all these adjustments go back to size quality you got normal fine economy economy whatever quality for video is STD 640 by 480 that's high quality is great on this camera I never use the LP long play that's basic and you have wide which is pretty good too I haven't tried it but I know I used it on one of my cast years I had in the past EV shift auto balance and ISO and metering color filter sharpness saturation contrast flash flash intensity and then we're back to the normal where we started setup Panel, iFi, sounds, startup, file number continuing, continue, continue, world time, timestamp, adjust time, date, language, sleep, on or off, auto power off is on for five minutes. <sighs> we got record, play, power on, USB massive storage, or PT, PTP pick bridge. Video out. That's for U.S. Palace for Europe areas. Format the card and reset. And that'll do it. And this is your play button. Back. There's no files to play back. And I think I covered the whole camera in less than nine minutes. I'm pretty sure to not forget anything. Oh wait a minute, I did. What is this? Okay. Playback pictures. And then you hit this again. But I just hit okay. Hit 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 play. If there's some if there's something to play back, you hit menu, and you have slideshow, red eye, DPOF printing. That's print. That's for printing pictures out from the camera. Protect, on or off rotation, resize, trimming, dubbing, copy. Setup. You have okay. The same old thing here. I like this function, like I was saying, where is it now? Copy. I can copy from the pictures from here and copy them onto my SD card. Most cameras you can do that with. Okay, I think I covered a whole camera up. I'm pretty sure that's what that's for. Copy. This function can't be used. Yeah, there's no SD card, that's why. And there's no um, pictures on here that to um, copy to from camera to card. I covered it, I think. Any questions or if I left anything out, that will be in a third review. Otherwise, I got to get a head start on taking more photos, video, and posting them up on YouTube. Thanks for watching and goodbye.